What's going on everyone? Welcome back to some more stadium creator in this video We have a bunch of stadiums being showcased So make sure you stick around until the very end so you don't miss out on any of the awesome stadiums Starting things off with this very very awesome looking stadium. This is apparently Fenway Park from 1912 to 1918 I'm not exactly sure how accurate it is but it looks so awesome. I thought the design was really, really awesome. Again, I absolutely love the brick building in the background. It just reminds me of Boston and, you know, the old buildings there. So really, really good job. I really like the outfield. It looks really fantastic. Bunch of trees all the way around the stadium. You also have some road as well. Couple buildings on the outside around the stadium as well. But overall, they did a great job. Starting things off with a really, really awesome stadium. This is based off of the Florida State Seminoles college baseball team. And all I have to say is this is so realistic. They put so much detail into the stadium. I mean, go Google the Florida State Seminoles college baseball team, their stadium, and take a look at that versus this stadium. Because my goodness. They put a lot of work into this and they put a lot of detail as well. I mean, it is so realistic to the real thing and I'm just blown away by it. So really, really good job and a great way to start this video. Here's the next stadium that we are taking a look at. Another college looking stadium and this one is fantastic. Once again, we got a bunch of hills in the background, bunch of trees. I absolutely love that. but. In right field, I love this little grassy patch over there. It just looks so nice. And not only that, but we have it over here with a very custom looking bullpen. I mean, just take a look at that. It just looks so realistic right over here. And over here, it just looks so clean right there as well. And just overall, the entire stadium just looks really good. They put a lot of detail and effort into it. So really good job on it. Here's the next stadium we are taking a look at. This one's pretty interesting. We got some baseball stuff right over here. Bunch of restaurants and props over here. But the main attraction is the football stadium with the full seating right over here. Looks very, very awesome. Right next to the baseball field. You could hit a home run through the uprights for the football stadium. Pretty awesome, isn't it? So that's very cool. Lots of awesome props. And a nice big city in the background with a big parking lot as well. Overall, they did a pretty good job on the stadium. Here's the next one we are taking a look at. This one is pretty awesome as well. I really like the style. 36,000 capacity. It looks like they used one of the templates, but it looks really awesome. But take a look at center field. They did a great job with this nice little walkway right over here with some stairs. And you got some nice sitting area right here in center field of course you got a camera because it's probably the houston astros that have this as a stadium but yeah center field looks really really nice i really like it i like the flags i like the statue in the background in the trees as well as the building so overall they did a great job a lot of detail and i like the props as well so really good job on the city we are starting things off with this awesome stadium it's a golf course baseball stadium. I absolutely love how creative that idea is. Looks very, very awesome. I love the parking lot on either side of the stadium. Looks very, very cool. And over here, you can see the little uh, golf course, little props over here. You can see, you know, a nice little tower right over here. We got a baseball glove there. We got a giant lighthouse 961 feet away. Trying to hit those props, that would be pretty insane. 634 feet, as you can see. Uh, hot air balloon, 742 feet. Very, very cool, very creative. Try and hit those props. Let me know in the comments down below. If you use the stadium, let me know which one you can hit. Maybe we'll try and do a challenge in the stadium and try that. So let me know if you want to see that and let's get into the next one. Here's the next city we are taking a look at. This one is a baseball stadium right over here. And over in left field, we got a basketball court and it's like an NBA court basically. Absolutely awesome. Again, very creative. Not only 
You can watch your favorite baseball team, but you can also watch your favorite NBA team at any time. It can either be at the same time or maybe, you know, separately. But overall, they did a great job on this. Very creative. Awesome idea. Here's the next stadium we are taking a look at. This one is both a baseball stadium and a soccer slash football, whatever you want to call it, uh, field, stadium, whatever, again. So this one is very creative. I love the stands on the wall right over here with both, you know, the baseball scoreboards. Very creative idea to implement that. And, you know, you have the stands wrapping around all the way down to here where you could sit for the soccer game or, you, you know, you can cut it off for the baseball. Just a really good idea, really good job. I really like it. Here's the next one we are taking a look at. This one is very cool as well. It's a baseball stadium right over here and we have American football right over here. I like the scoreboard being at angle. I love the fence right there. It looks so realistic to, you know, how high school teams have it. And I love the football stadium with a bridge over it as well. That's very cool. And overall, it looks very, very creative. I just love these multi-sport stadiums. Today, we are starting things off in Queens, New York in this stadium. I absolutely love this one. This one is so creative and awesome looking. It definitely gives me Queens, New York vibes. I'm not from New York. I've never actually visited New York, but from what I've seen of New York, this definitely gives me the vibes of New York. It just does. It looks so good. I love the road all the way around the stadium. Bunch of houses, old rustic buildings, you know, brick buildings, whatever you want to call them. The bridge in the background, just everything about it just looks so good. They did a really good job. A lot of detail, a lot of hard work. Good job on this one. Taking a look at the next stadium. This one is awesome as well. This one is a lumber yard. And they did a really good job with all of the trees all the way around. And I like this little area right here. It definitely gives me the outdoor vibes, you know, like Colorado and places like that. It definitely looks really, really good. And then behind here, you got a bunch of nice umbrella seating, the entrance. It just looks so nice. I love center field. They did a really good job with that. 41,000 capacity, not bad. Really, really good job. This is the next stadium we are taking a look at. This one is in Tennessee. This one looks really, really awesome. We got a big bridge in the background and I like the suites up there. That looks so nice and awesome. Definitely a really good job on the stadium. Left field looks really awesome. I like this little concourse area right over there. Center field looks great as well. Tennessee Park right there. And right field looks great as well. I love all the signs used and I love this little slope right there. That looks so nice and very unique. Really, really good job on this stadium. Here's the next stadium we are taking a look at. This one is really, really nice looking. I absolutely just love left field with all these nice looking fountains. We got this nice little fence here with plants on top, bunch of rocks. It just looks so cool. Then we got some buildings with some seating on top love that center field looks really nice as well you got this walkway right here along the fountains and then you can step up here and go behind the scoreboard and get to the other side of the stadium very thoughtful and just everything about the stadium is thought really well out so they did a really nice job i love the patio right over here looks so nice and cozy sitting on over there and then you got this nice building with some signs as well overall they did a fantastic job starting things off with this awesome looking stadium i loved just the preview of seeing this stadium and man oh man they did a great job on it i love the city in the background the nice scoreboard center field just looks so good in general over here down the right field line you got a couple trees behind here we got a parking garage right there as well looks good same with over here just looks so good 41,000 capacity and overall great job here's the next stadium we are taking a look at this one is so awesome as well i love the rocks in the outfield right over here it just looks so clean and awesome i like the double stacked 
seating over here and over there shelf squad slam deck i like that name pretty cool you got the signs in the background nice custom scoreboard i really really like that it looks so good and then the city in the background as well overall it looks so great and of course you got an extra baseball stadium right there and some road and some houses as well overall they did a great job here's the next day we are taking a look at this one is so awesome looking i really like the right field with this nice big brick wall reminds me of the green monster but in right field and it's a brick wall instead also over here is a nice batting cage it might be like a bullpen right over here not completely sure but looks really really cool over here in left field we got some bleachers and some empty custom bleachers i really like that looks awesome over there and then over here you have a nice little deck over here looks really really awesome a nice walkway all the way up here and up here we have kind of like a suite custom suite looking area looks awesome really good job on the stadium here's the next stadium we are taking a look at this one is awesome i like the name it definitely goes along with the theme you got a bunch of rocks hiding the stadium and that's why it's called the hidden stadium i really like that a bunch of palm trees it definitely looks like a stadium that you would see in the future or back in time if you know baseball was a thing so this is really really awesome i really like it it's very creative as well i love the fountains over here in the outfield you got volcano over here in the mountain just looks so cool really good job on the stadium starting things off with this very awesome stadium i love that it's kind of surrounded by like the rocky mountains i forget the exact oh a canyon i guess that's what it would be but i absolutely love that they did such a great job integrating the stadium into that and they have a giant bridge up above it just looks so cool and very clean to play at i love it center field looks great with the giant scoreboard the custom scoreboard i should say bunch of american flags a scoreboard right there and there the stadium seating looks really really nice as well and just overall the stadium is really good good job on it here's the next stadium we are taking a look at this is another college stadium and as you may know i absolutely love college stadiums so taking a look it looks really incredible i love the walkway right up here it just looks so nice and clean you of course got some grass patch out there i love stadiums with this it's so much fun to sit out in the grass and watch the game and catch a ball uh you also got the scoreboard right up here super custom really nice looking and a bunch of buildings in the background overall they did a fantastic job on the stadium here's the next stadium we are taking a look at i absolutely love center field right over here it just looks so nice with a giant concourse over here a bunch of shopping places that you can go to maybe restaurants some merch stores stuff like that got a nice little building up there as well scoreboard right here batting eye looks good got a couple statues all around got the baseball glove and a baseball field right up there a couple other extra perks and some props overall fantastic job.